everyone welcome to my review of a mass effect 3 collector's action figure um this is from series 2 this is miranda um and in series 1 they had uh the figurines of like they had commander shepherd and tally uh, but this one they have legion morgan garrison and this one which is miranda super super nice you'll never guess how much i paid for this it was only five bucks and where did i find it for five bucks at toys r us this thing was originally twenty dollars and I've been waiting for them to go down, but uh, and then they were always on the shelf, but the, no one was ever buying them. So I guess Toys R Us decided to mark them down to five bucks. So it's totally worth to go out to Toys R Us, see if you can find them. They mostly have Miranda and Morden, but just go out and see if you can find them. Because five bucks is a really, really good price for this. So let's just get on with the unboxing and the review. So as far as what's in the packaging, of course you have like the background of the actual um, packaging. And then there's the very back of it. There's nothing inside, so just kind of there. Um, but what I found really interesting is that there was a special code, which I will be covering up so no one steals it. Um, thank you for your purchasing an official Bioware product, and I can register it to get like unique codes in Mass Effect 3 and promotions and in-game content, so that's really cool. So I decided to have that. I'll probably put that in later. So I mean, that might be worth five bucks in itself. So then this is still packaged up a little more, so I'm just going to un- package this and then we can get on to reviewing Miranda and there she is all out of the package and actually it feels like it's really nicely made uh wow her belt is actually not like just painted on there it's actually like movable so that's cool um I don't know if her, her head turns she can she can't move her arms uh you can move her legs I believe I'm not really sure what's all movable um but I won't be moving her around much anyway uh, it also fortunately comes with a stand so you can like put her on put her on the desk um but what was really cool she looks really nice up on the desk this is so worth five bucks um she also comes with actually like a gun a weapon which i didn't notice in the boxing until i unboxed it because i don't know if it was like hidden or something but i didn't even notice that so that's really nice i guess you can just uh have her hold it Okay, I actually just ended up putting the gun in her belt. I couldn't figure out how to really put it in her hand, but nonetheless, this looks nice. Um, I'll kind of zoom on the face there. I know my camera's making it a little hard to see, but it is really nicely detailed. And I, a lot of people think Miranda in the series is a jerk, but, but, I <laughs> get it, but, but I really, I really think she's a great character. And this is totally worth five bucks. It makes me want to go back and get more and see if I can go find Garrus or something. I know that series one is harder to find, but this is definitely worth the five bucks. It looks really, really nice on my desk. Like, I'm so happy that I picked this up. So if you have a Toys R Us in your town, they are selling these for five bucks and they are worth it. Like, for size comparison, just to uh, give you what the size is. Like, here, I'll take a Sonic Hedgehog 2 box. Take a Genesis. And it's, it's pretty tall, actually. Like, Next to a uh, next to a 3DS box, it's relatively tall. If you can see that, so it's really nice, and I like it a lot. Definitely worth five bucks. I mean, heck, I think it's worth twenty bucks. But five, you cannot beat that. Go find these, you guys, you Mass Effect fans. Don't let me down. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the review. Let me know if there's any other things you want me to review, or just anything you see sitting on my desk, or you know, in the background of my videos. Just let me know. So I hope you enjoyed the review, and I'll see you guys later.